Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Um, this is a video for anyone out there having an issue with the Canon MX922 not printing. Um, I was having the issue that when I try to print out, it's telling me to put paper on the lower cassette. And I actually had paper in there and it wouldn't print and it just kept giving me the same issue no matter what I did. I went in there, um, fixed the paper. I went in there, make sure the trays all the way in. I checked everything else just to make sure that all the settings are correct. I turned it off, turned it back on, made sure that I had the latest software installed for Canon and the issue kept happening. Um, I went online. I couldn't find any video on how to resolve it. Um, I see that many people out there are having the same issue with the Canon um, X MX922 not printing. So I decided to come up with this video after I found the resolution for it because I figured that a lot of people out there are going to need this video. Um, so what I did was two things. Um, I opened the tray, right? So you open the tray on the bottom. And you see these little adjusters here? What I did was I adjusted mine's. Mine's was all the way out. So let me show you this. So mine's was all the way out. So it kind of leaves a little bit of room right here on the side. So all I did was I adjusted it in. You just press it in. There you go. And when you do that, it takes away the little space right here. I don't know why that has to do anything with it, but I think what it does, it holds the paper in place. So therefore, um, it doesn't seem like there's no paper in there, I guess. So I did that. That was the first thing I did. The second thing I did was I went into the settings. I didn't even realize um, I could ch change the settings. So the lower tray is for anything like US letter, legal, and up. The upper tray is for anything that is 5.7 inches and smaller. Um, so just in case, so all you have to do is make sure you um, turn on your printer um, Click on the first one here on the copy I guess and then you're gonna get this little setting here it says print setting if you click there on The little button right here on the bottom where it says print setting It's gonna give you um, settings that you could change your printer. What I've noticed was that my setting on the page size wasn't on letter and letter is the standard size for regular paper, which is U.S. letter 8.5 by 11 inches, which is the paper that we're all trying to print at. So what I did was I went in here and I changed it. It was actually on 5 by 7. Now, I do remember a couple months ago I had printed out some pictures. So maybe that's my fault for not changing it back. However, I do notice a lot that a lot of people online are having the same issue. So maybe it's just something that... I thought the printer would recognize what type of document I'm printing, but I guess it doesn't. So what you have to do is you have to change the size here and then you'll change it to make sure that, well, you can change it to the size that you need. However, letter is the standard size. So pick that one, press OK, and that's all you have to do. Once you do that, pretty much open it back up and then you could print anything out. I'm going to print something out now so you can kind of see. Um, that for me right now is working. So I'm going to go ahead and print something. Regular printing. I didn't have to do anything. It's going to recognize that I'm printing something that is letter size that I didn't need to shrink it. And it's going to shrink it. It's going to print it out for me. So um, within a few seconds, it should be working. So hopefully this will be the resolution that everyone out there is looking for that no one has been able to post or no one has been able to figure out, I guess. So I hope that this um, resolves everyone's issue. Um, so far, it looks like it's working. Um, so let's see. Oh, it did it again for me. You see how it says there's no paper in the cassette lower. Check and press the following. So this is the issue that everyone's having. So for me, I'm going to do the same thing again. So I'm going to go in here, right? I'm gonna fix the paper, which is what originally I was telling you guys that I did. I'm gonna put it back on the bottom. And I'm gonna wait now, let's see. 
See, it's the craziest thing. <laughs> you guys saw, I didn't do anything else. All I did was fix the bottom <laughs> of the train and voila, it worked. So you have to do those two things combined. One, make sure that the bottom of the tray, the little clips are clipping all the way in to make the paper fit really tight. And then make sure you go to print settings and change it to US letter. And hopefully it will work for you. I have done it a couple times and it has worked for me, even though I had to go back again and, and fix it for some reason. So hopefully this will be a short-term, maybe a, a long-term solution. So thank you guys. Bye-bye.